Alright guys, it's the Middle Age Gamer here, and today we're going to be playing, of course, Ship Simulator Extremes. This is going to be my fourth video. We're going to be doing a Greenpeace mission, and it's going to be the No Scudding. And that's not very nice, you douchebag. Anyways, this is difficulty is easy, it's very filled with action which none of these missions have been filled with the action in my opinion and we're playing in Rotterdam which is the maps that the other missions have been on as well and it says an oil company is planning on was it scuttling I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right their oil storage facility the Grand Star you are going to take Esperanza and face the odds in order to stop them absolutely exciting I mean look look at that ocean too Anyway, let's go ahead and put play and let's get into the mission Okay, so this is obviously not the Rainbow Warrior, something different, pretty interesting. Anyways, leave the port and sail towards the Grand Star Storage Facility, Major Alert Captain and oil company is going to scuttle their oil storage facility, the Grand Star, when to move in fast to reach them before it happens so our activists can get on board and prevent the explosion. Absolutely amazing, let's see where the hell we're going first. And this is one of those maps that's probably going to bring us out into another area. Which I don't particularly care for. I think they should make it pretty streamlined. Should we have to go out the entire channel to the ocean and then back in? In my opinion, neither here or there. I didn't build the game. So who am I to complain? Let's go ahead and get off the dock here. Ooh, we've got some new controls here. I don't even know how to use any of that. Hmm. Okay. We'll see what happens. And can I go left and right? Yeah. Okay. And we gotta get turned around, it looks like. I'm not sure how to do that at this point. Maybe we don't want to hit the back end of the dock there. Ooh, 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 ooh. I think I just tapped it right there. Not a big worry. Let's make sure we're not going to hit anything. Yeah, let's, let's see inside. Definitely not the Rainbow Warrior. Okay. Again, I'm not sure what this controller does. I'm not going to worry about it right now. I'm thinking it's to get on and off the dock to prevent what we did right there. This thing's leaning quite a bit, though, isn't it? Yeah, it definitely is. Beautiful ship, though. Look at look at that rainbow. So I guess it's the Esperanza. Esperanza. Am I going the right way? Yeah, I am. Okay. Go ahead and get out to port here. Whoa, 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 whoa. And I'm still going right. That's not good. A little bit of a delay there. There we go. I guess it takes a while for it to go back the way you're planning. So, and I'm going back right. Not good. Not good at all. Jesus, I gotta get this thing going straight.
Got a nice little barge coming next to us. He's off, awfully close. Just get out of the way. Let's to the horn at him, you asshole. Way too close. Look at that. That's no respect in the canals of Rotterdam at all. Let me go ahead and get off the moor. Let's make sure our running lights are on real quick. There we go. Lit up like a Christmas tree now. And let's get the hell out of town. And again, I think this is one of those maps that's going to probably switch off on me into a completely different area. Probably the Rotterdam map that we're used to. Don't particularly care for that, but um, we don't have much of an option. It looks like we do have ribs there. Yeah, I got two ribs. So we can deploy those to attack the assholes that we're going to visit. Let's go forward. Nope, just left and right. Okay. Pretty nice radar on there. So I'm not going to worry about speeding it up on this portion of the mission. Seems like we're about to hit the next map here. First time it happened, I thought uh, the, the game was crashing itself, but... There we go. It's acting like it's gonna crash. Oh, oh, and it, it has to load. Look at that. Okay. So put us out here with a helicopter. Very, very interesting. I'm not sure if we can fly that, but that'd be absolutely amazing if we could. It doesn't look like we can though. So I'm heading out that way. Let's see where the hell we are. Looks like we're literally in the middle of the ocean. Which is uh, fine by me. I can't hit anything. And the objective hasn't changed quite yet. So I'll probably go ahead and... Uh, well, no, don't, don't have to speed it up. Look at this. There it is. We've got company, though. Deploy a ribbon. Try to bait the ship away from the platform. ship away from the platform. I'm not sure how the hell they want me to do that. Let's go ahead and deploy the rib. Let's get on it and let's get Where's this guy. There we go. Look at these waves. They're absolutely amazing. There we go. Pretty choppy. Bye bye the Esperanza with the beautiful rainbow. I got a mission to do. So I gotta try to bait the ship away from the platform. Not sure what it wants me to do at all. It says we're gonna use our helicopter to reach the platform, but in order to do that, we need to bait the way the ship from guarding it. That water cannon is really protecting us from landing on the platform. Deploy your fast boat try to close towards the second ship and then running away once it starts chasing you move fast and be careful that's what we're gonna do and let's see if this water cannon's gonna hit me oh 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 Quick drive by. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stuck on the ship there. That's not good. Let's go ahead and reverse out of here. I'm sure we could have died at that point. So it didn't hit, hurt my uh, health at all, which is good. So I guess we're just keeping the water cannon pointing towards us, is the only thing we're really doing. Which is fine. It looks like they're getting on the uh, platform up there. And gotta watch out for that water cannon.
boats down there as you can see and the helicopter is going back which is good not good all right and that ship is it turning around it looks like it is turning around and should I go back to the boat I'm thinking I probably should yep since the activists are on the oil platform and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and head back to the boat. Yeah, it says return the rib to the Esperanza. You did it. I'm absolutely a badass, as you can tell. And I think that guy is uh, definitely chasing me, so I'm gonna get this rib back on and then really uh, steam the ship back into port. I think it looks like it's leaning. Maybe I should have checked on it. Nah, probably just from the waves, huh? There's a helicopter up there. So, whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, man. My dog just fucking pulled the cord out and yanked it out. <coughs> That's why I stopped the mission real quick. What an asshole. No, I don't want to quit the current game. Just want to get the rib back on there. So, oh, put that one back, put that one back. And look, the mission's been succeeded. We don't even have to return the port. I don't know what's, what's going on with this game, but the missions get shorter and shorter. Absolutely insane. It should take longer, but we got two points towards the special and three points towards Prince the green piece not sure why it says point or 0 0.3 but it actually gives you three full points on the main crashing. screen let's go and view our reward and no scudding movie so let's go ahead and watch this movie go ahead and enjoy again this, this is the middle aged gamer and i'll be posting the, uh, the next video for the green piece mission here shortly on youtube as well that was difficult we had to fly the helicopter through the water spray coming from some of the surrounding boats uh, to get them on the rig. But once they were on board, it was quite effective because the rig was so huge that they could hide for days without being discovered. It was different. It was it was technically a challenge, but it was it proved very effective. It proved so effective that today, rigs aren't dumped at sea; they're recycled on shore. <laughs> 